Alright guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. In today's video we're looking at the, uh, the top 100 players in the NFL for 2020. And at number 98, in our third video of the series, we're looking at Brandon Brooks. Not a bad name actually. Let's hope he can um, live up to it. He is a guard uh, for the Eagles and he looks absolutely monstrous. I mentioned that in the last video. Um, there's another big player that plays for the Eagles at the moment. His name's Jordan Mylata and he is an Australian and um, obviously myself being from New Zealand we well we're pretty much brother and sister so I support any Australians or any New Zealanders doing anything internationally and he's actually I'm pretty sure he's got a starting spot now or something. Anyways today's video is not about Jordan it's about his mate in the O-line Brandon Brooks. Yeah old Brandy Let's go. Carson Wentz. Okay, this guy must be like six foot six. Probably about 320 pounds, and he's a rookie. Things on didn't the list. look good when Brandon Brooks tore his Achilles in the 2018 NFC Divisional Playoffs. He tore his Achilles. Remarkably, just eight months later, Brooks returned to action and put together another outstanding season. Oh, you love to hear that. Miles Sanders. He runs right behind Brandon Brooks. They don't touch him until he's 10 yards down the field. Love running to that race out. <laughs> the largest offensive lineman I've ever seen face to face. 350, just solid. 350. Heavy guy. Just man meets. Good blocking up front by Brandon Brooks. You see how easy it is for the running back. Oh, mate! How would you feel being Howard? The hole will be there. Every time. I guarantee you that. Probably, you know, one of the top guys at his position. Look at this guy's neck. Can move really and every well other football it's player's neck. It's just monstrous. It's just. To this linebacker, watch I was going to say monstrous, but that means I would have said monstrous probably three times in this video already, and that's just too much. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about right there! An outstanding job of executing the screen pass. Brandon Brooks, unbelievable job of clearing space. He's going to go down the field as well. He's got a bit of pace about him. His size. It's not the only strength of his game. He can move with you now. He knows how to play your scheme. He knows how to wait for you to come to him. Brooks uses martial yeah, he, arts he to doesn't help look his slow. rehabilitation, which he'll need to do again as he's missing this season with a torn Achilles. <laughs> this translates the best to what I do on the field. What? Did you guys just hear what I, he what he tore his Achilles again? That's a lot of hand stuff. No. To quicken your hand speed, being no. able to be not just fast, but precise with your hand placement. Somebody trying to grab you, which happens on the field, you know, being able to pull them. You know, I'm going to have to look that up. Being able to get my hands on the defensive line faster than they can get their hands on me. He kind of seems to sit all sorts of pass rush moves down. No one is better at the guard spot in the league. Look how, look how strapped up his, 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 um, his cleats are. Just controlling the line of scrimmage. Carson, he's got all day back there to throw the football. Look so much one. weight. Look and at that guy. Him to find Sanders. Brandon, he's special, man. And it showed a lot this year. He's a hell of a player, man. I love playing with him. Fuck, man. Brandon Brooks. Let's have a look. Okay. Uh, he's been in the league for a fair while. Since 2012, he went in the third round to the Houston Texans, spent four years there, then got signed on a five-year deal with the Eagles in 2016, uh, where he is currently at. On December 17th, he was named to his second Pro Bowl. 
and 18 or 19 he's he tore his Achilles then he signed a four-year extension through to 2024 played a great season as we just saw was named to his third straight Pro Bowl his third straight Pro Bowl even though he got through a torn Achilles that's that's insane um, on December 29th 2019 he suffered a dislocated shoulder in the last regular season game forcing him to miss the postseason well that's frustrating on June 15th 2020 it was announced that Brooke tore his Achilles and will miss the upcoming 2020 season he was placed on the active slash physically unable to perform list at the start of training camp on August 4th 2020 and placed on reserve list at the start of the regular season Um, I'm going to have to read further into that because it is not... What the fuck? Eagles right guard Brandon Brooks on Monday tore his left Achilles tendon while working out at the Novacare Complex. I'm told Brooks knew the severity of the injury right away and he was devastated. He injured himself running on a practice field. Brandon Brooks, Twitter, June 16th, 2020. So I guess now that news is out, yes, I tore my other my other Achilles. Ugh. What? What the fuck? That's unbelievable. But actually it's not, because he's 350 pounds, and that's a lot of weight, isn't it? So, to be fair, he's done it once on both sides. They say that tendons tend to heal if done properly stronger than before just like in Dragon Ball Z if you're a Saiyan and you get hurt but not killed you come back stronger every single time um, I feel like that's what both of his Achilles tendons are going to do um, guys thank you for watching for all your Major Key Physiques gear head to www.majorkeyphysiques.com um, consider subscribing if you haven't Consider joining. Consider becoming a channel member. Um, I haven't quite worked out what the perks are going to be, but there will be some. And to be honest, regardless of the perks, that is just hugely appreciated. It is, it is supporting the channel. It's supporting these videos. And um, much love. See you in the next one. Peace out.